you know. I got a simple sword charge, and they arrested me um, uh, down the block where I live on the same street. I was staying at a Super 8 motel, and the detectives, you know, they said, uh, oh, you know, uh, you're a missing person, this and the other thing, and later, you know, they handcuffed me, but they didn't read me my Miranda rights, the detectives, and they said, Elizabeth wants you, and I knew Elizabeth, you know, the city, this was in Rollway, two cities away, but you couldn't understand why, I said, wow, I wasn't, like, I, I wasn't there for, like, you know, four or five days, I was a like, young, yeah, I didn't, and then I kind of started putting it together by starting, you know, mess around with them. Anyway, fast forward, you know, a, a day later, I get arraigned in Essex County Jail. They took me to Union County Jail, and they took me to Essex County Jail. You know, that, uh, you know the, the, the cuffs on the legs, you know, the shackles, the van ride, right? they purposely you know, made it bumpy. I was like, it's fucking ridiculous. Like, you're not scared of that. Was it that bad? You know, it was just boring. It was boring in there, especially the next day, you know, they had the Raymond. It was like 11 a.m., 12 p.m., something like that. It, it, me and like, like everybody else that was when we were in the general cell or the big holding cell, you know, we went in there. We had an arraignment, I believe. Everybody had it. And, you know, it went by fast. But the judge, you know, she didn't really uh, specify too much, you know. I think she said, well, what do you know, stuff like that. And I was just like, you know, I didn't do anything wrong. She said JK. I think she said JK, I believe. Well, maybe even not. I don't remember, but it was like, you know, I told everything that happened, you know. I said, I went in, I drove by, and I had toy guns. You know, the same thing I told in Rollway police. Also, I was thinking, like, you know, why don't you just relay messages from what? I mean, you guys must talk. But then, you know, Rollway uh, cops, detectives, you know, they're complaining that Elizabeth guys don't like them. Like, they were pushing around like they are fucking nothing and stuff. They had no solidarity, but the judge... Oh, she said, you know, I was like, well, you maybe shouldn't go there, this and the other. I'm like, oh, all right, but it's like, you know, I didn't argue too much. I was, I was kind of creeped out. I mean, I was kind of scared. You know, it's like, you know, I caught a charge. You know, they got me for fucking nothing. You know, it's like, you know, who knows what the fuck else they're going to do. And they probably, or Elizabeth, I mean, I had two toy guns. There was a guy that came in there, and he was, you know, he got he aggravated assault or something like that on his, on his tenant or his neighbor, I think on his tenant, and then he was talking about two actual guns. So I was thinking, like, what if they just fucking, you know, do my fingerprints or some shit? I was fucking shook, but the judge didn't know anything about, supposedly, I'm pretty sure they knew, but it's like, she didn't even say this and the other things. Like, I had to explain that I came in with a toy gun, I waved at him, you know, JK was Janos, and, you know, it was like, you know, I, I, I actually told the name, it must be Yano, she didn't even fucking say who, what his last name was, or first name, you know, it's like, so, I, I mean, I assume it was Elizabeth, and so it had to be that, you know, she didn't even say about toy guns or anything, like, I was the one talking about it, and part of me was like, should I even fucking say that, I mean, I'm not gonna fucking lie, I'm not gonna fucking hide, I was gonna shoot the guy and shit, he's the one that fucking made threats against me a day or two days earlier, or three days, But anyway, I don't mean dismiss it anyway. So it's like, you know, if you think about it, Yano, like he made the fucking threats. Uh, you know, a day or two days later, I pointed the, the toy gun. day or two days later, I pointed at Mario's Ridge. And he pretended as himself. He didn't even see me pointing that, I believe. And like the next day or two days later, I got arrested like November, something like that. But the judge didn't even mention Mario's Ridge nonetheless. She didn't mention that. She said, JK, this, that. Then I read the paperwork. When they released me, or actually, I went to Elizabeth uh, Elizabeth Municipal Court. That's when I got the paperwork, and it's a JK scared for his life. This and the other thing, it's it just a fucking ridiculous nonsense, you know. But I told the judge piece by piece the toy guns, and you know, and roll away this and the other thing. And I don't know if she asked me why are we there. I was like, I was recording a YouTube video. I didn't talk about my whole experience. I think I tried to say the guy was not a good boss. You know, Yannick was, was a decent person, but I was recording YouTube videos how, you know, they didn't do landscaping in the front yard. I mean, the front, um, the front yard, it over floods. I don't think I even got the, the wording out, to tell you the truth. I don't remember correctly, but, you know, as far as arraignment, it's like, I felt like, you know, they should have some information and stuff like that. And, you know, actually, uh, later, I think the judge told me, oh, don't worry about it. It's really not that important or something like that. 